could light rail right into Virginia Beach in the near future. Well, Mayor Will Sessom says yes, but what will it really take to bring the tide to the resort city? Ten of your signs, Liz Palka joined us with more this morning. And when we say what will it take, we're really talking about what will it cost. We're to make talking that about money with that. We're talking about millions of dollars, Don and Carrie. Sessoms gave us some approximate numbers to have the tide run all the way to the ocean front. It could cost eight hundred million dollars to town center. 250 million dollars. Now the mayor wants to know if you want light rail in Virginia Beach. That is, if you're a resident, he's pushing for a non-binding referendum to be put on your ballot in November. Let's see what the voters think about pursuing a light rail today. If, if they say no, we won't. If they say yes, well, we'll pursue it. Even if they say pursue it, there's no guarantee that we're going to bring light rail to Virginia Beach. And Sessom saying there's no guarantee because so much analysis will go into a potential light rail project in Virginia Beach. And there was a light rail referendum on ballots in 99. The public voted no to light rail then, so city council dropped it. But it's been 13 years, and Carrie and Don, the mayor says he thinks a lot of people have changed their minds since then. Yeah, especially now that they have something to, to look at, you know, up and running in Norfolk instead of just trying to picture what light rail would be like. Exactly. Thanks, Liz.